At Hockenheim, these long, long straights means that cars like this Jordan Peugeot will do 215 miles an hour. That's faster than at any other Grand Prix circuit. With straight line speed at a premium, it's important to have the smallest wings on the car that you can. Look how thin this rear wing is, look how much gap there is underneath. Now contrast that to this wing, which is run at the Monaco circuit when cornering speed is more important. It's a much bigger wing, more grip, less straight line speed. Indeed, put this wing on the Jordan here at Hockenheim and it wouldn't do 215 miles an hour, but it would do just 175. Now at 200 miles an hour, the car still has about 1,000 kilos of downforce. That's like 10, 12 people standing on top of the car. But down at 60 miles an hour, and that's crucially the speed that the chicanes are taking at, that downforce decimates right down to just 100 kilos. And so the cars are very tiptoey, the grip is very minimal. We're going to see locking wheels, sliding curbs, and possibly even spins. Hockenheim is a tricky place.